Welcome back. We've been counting down all week to the great American dog show returning to Schaumburg. And this year it's sure to be cuter than ever. We can say that because of an event involving puppies. I mean, puppies are always cute, aren't I mean, they? Puppies are always <laughs> cute. We love our dogs here at CBS, too. And we uh, also want to now welcome in uh, my dear friend Dana Kozlov with a sweetheart right there. I'm not if we got a little boy, a little girl, but whatever, it's a sweetheart. And a uh, sweetheart, yeah, girl. And then we've got a friend from the dog show. Dana, take it away. Yeah, hey, Brad. So first of all, this is Marlene. I mean, you know, everyone wants to know the uh, dog's name first, but I also am with James Donahue. I said that correctly, you did I not? Yes. Thank you, yay. Uh, he is with the International Kennel Club of Chicago, and we really appreciate you being here this morning. Oh, thanks. Thank We're very you excited. for bringing Marlene, too. Absolutely. I think she's having a good time. She has been entertaining me, I can tell you that. So, um, you know, first of all, James, tell us more about this new puppy competition that has been added to the Great American Dog Show this year. Yeah, of course. So we wanted to do something special this year to kind of showcase the new up-and-coming stars that mm -hmm. the dog exhibitors have coming out this year. It's always exciting in January to see people's new up-and-coming hopefuls. So on Saturday, um, we have the Great American Puppy Show for the first time, and we were really excited to see over 200 puppies wow. entered Yeah, in this special event. And they're going to range anywhere from four months of age up until a year old. That's what we typically consider puppies. So like Marlene here, who's six months old, she'll give you an idea of some of the, the cute kind of puppies that you can see from all breeds. Um, it's going to be a really exciting event. But she won't be in the competition. She won't. No, no, since I'm one of the coordinators, she has to sit on the sidelines and kind of judge everybody else and tell them what they're doing wrong. But, you know, puppies are puppies, right? Absolutely. So what are they able to do in competition? Well, we like to get our puppies out early so that they get to see the world. They um, have some socialization, learn what it's all about to get them ready for when they are older for their careers. But there's a lot of really fun antics that go in. They always keep you on your toes. You never know when they're going to decide to do things things their own way. So, I mean, it keeps us on the on our toes as exhibitors and judges, but it's fun for the audience to see as well. I, I'm going rogue here on this question, so don't move the prompter, but do you take into consideration puppies will be puppies when absolutely. judging? Absolutely, absolutely. Know? <laughs> yeah, you know, we, we always say that we judge the dog on the day, but it has to be appropriate for where they are in their own development. Right, right. So, yeah, it's not like a veteran dog, a exactly. veteran competitor. So um, what exactly are the judges looking for then? What sort of criteria? So every breed has its own written standard and that describes how the dog should be built, how they should move, and it all goes back to uh, historically the function that that breed evolves to perform. Mm -hmm. Whether they may, maybe were a hunting dog or a livestock guardian or like Marlene, just a companion dog. Mm -hmm. um, so they're seeing how each exhibit measures up to that standard. Okay, um, and then how long does that normally take? How long is the puppy competition? Um, so the puppy competition is going to go all day. I think the judging starts at 8 a.m. until they get through all 200 puppies. Oh my! We usually say that it takes about two minutes per dog yeah. in, a, in a dog show, but with puppies, you have to allow a little extra time for the antics and shenanigans that are going to, going to, you know, Again, eat up some of the will time. Be puppies. Absolutely. James Donahue, thank you so much for joining us this Absolutely. morning. Absolutely, thank Thanks you for to having us. as well, and I want to mention the Great American Dog Show taking place January 19th to the 21st at the Renaissance Schomburg Convention Center, and um, we will be there. Uh, uh, CBS2 will be there. I'll be out there Friday. Come say hi. And again, we really appreciate you making the trip here today. Thanks for having us.